White supremacy is a deeply rooted issue in colonized societies and it must be addressed if we are to stop living under oppressive rule. It is a complex problem, but there are steps we can take to begin to overcome it. We need to start by educating all citizens on the history of white supremacy and its effects on society, then work together to create systems that promote equity and inclusion. Non-whites should have control over the laws that structure their environments and the systems that serve them should benefit them. They should control the wealth generated from their past, present and future labor and contributions to society. We must also recognize biases and take steps to challenge them, while actively working against white supremacy in all aspects of life. By taking these steps, we can begin the process of dismantling white supremacy and creating a future that includes everyone who contributes. White supremacy manifests itself in many forms, from racial stereotyping to economic disparities. The most harmful is the control of politics, institutions and economies of non-whites. Admitting how white wealth and power was generated by systems at the expense of people of color is an important step in changing it. It faces opposition, but it is essential for creating a society that represents those who contribute. By speaking up and rejecting racism at the individual level, we can start to challenge the systems of oppression that have been put in place for centuries. We must also educate ourselves on the history and current reality of white control over non-whites so that we can better understand how to restructure it. Only by restructuring the economic, political, and institutional power that whites have over non-whites can we start to build a more just world for everyone.